What's going on, everybody? Patty Pockets 25 here, and I'm joined with my uh, good friend and cousin, Brocky Bro. Say hi. Hey, yo, what's happening, everybody? Uh, so, we're playing a new game, just came out. Uh, this is by the Game Grumps. It is called Dream Daddy Simulator. Um, might be a series, might not be, but, uh, you know... He's Brock is here visiting, so we're gonna we're gonna give it a try. You ready? Ready to get into this? Absolutely. Let's hit it up. I believe this just came out today, so we're gonna start ourselves a new game, and uh, we're gonna find our dream daddy. Dad tip: can't beat the whammy bar. Can't can't beat the whammy you are. Yep. Oh. That's that's your dad tip of the day. Dad tip thirty two. Alright. Z z z z z. Z Z Z Z Z Z Z. Who's sleeping? A oh, man. Dad. Still sleeping. Dad, wake up. <laughs> pretend to be dead. Okay, <laughs> we got some. We five more minutes. We can wake up or pretend to be dead. Pretend to be dead. <laughs> pretend to be dead. I let my tongue roll out my mouth and stop breathing. <laughs> <laughs> Amanda shakes me. Come on, Dad. This hasn't worked on me since I was six. <laughs> so, <laughs> so he's tried it a bunch of times. I'm sorry, Amanda. This is the end for me. <laughs> Dad, I swear to God. Amanda, I bequeath to you all my <laughs> earthly possessions. Spread my ashes <laughs> over my recliner. <laughs> okay, well, your corpse better get the ma the moving van because I'm. it's leaving soon. Okay, so is that our daughter? I'm guessing we're a dad too. Are we? Are we dating other dad? I didn't read into any of this game. No. I finally open my eyes and sit up. I'm lying in the middle of the living room, spoon spooning a moving box. Okay, I yawn <laughs> and stretch. Moving manda pa manda panda. <laughs> yikes, dad! G g yikes, dad! Breath. Go brush your teeth. <laughs> All right. Ah. Remember, dad tip number 19. Use your hips when throwing. <laughs> uh, dad tip... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we have to do it, dad. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> We're going to build our dad. So this is us. All right. Mm -hmm. I feel like we should be... Build that dad. We're going to be the... We're going to have, like, a more of a bigger dad, I say. Yeah. Uh, the bigger the better. He's a hairy guy. Oh, <laughs> he's Shrek. Uh, <laughs> him a, he's a really pale dad. Maybe he's a little bit tanner. There we go. Uh, <laughs> give him a real chiseled chin. <laughs> yeah, we'll give him a little bit of scruff going on there. Oh, yeah. This, this dad, I'm guessing, you know, this dad doesn't really, he doesn't have his wife around anymore. Maybe divorced. So, he doesn't get out much. So, he's also Goku. <laughs> <laughs> We're just making Goku. Uh, our dad, Goku. Our dad, he really likes anime. <laughs> <laughs> he loves he loves Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> so, he's also Goku. Uh, eyes. <laughs> <laughs> what are the traumatized ones? Where, where Top at? right. <laughs> ah yes, our our dad has seen some shit, <laughs> so he's gonna. Oh, you got hard eyes, oh. <laughs> snake eyes. All right, we're gonna go for these ones. Our dad, he's he's seen some things, you know. <laughs> uh, noses. Let's give our dad like a real beefy, like a. I say, like, maybe go for this one here. Yeah. Wait, that one good? Looks good. Mouths. So we got, like, our normal mouth here, and then we got... <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> the salty mouth. <laughs> Do we have a real salty dad? We could change his lip color. <laughs> yeah, let's do that. Let's. He has a toothpick, you know. He's he's a bit of a, he's a hardcore man huh. who likes anime. My eyebrows. 
Think of some real bushy yeah, ones. Yeah, you got the bush. Yeah, make them a little darker. Hmm. There we go. Does our dad have glasses? Hmm. I don't know. Let's to give him a little. Sh <laughs> they don't even look like they fit on his face. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's go for no glasses. Yeah. Piercings? I don't think our no. dad has any piercings. How about clothes? Let's give him a little... <laughs> 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 I feel like our dad's a classy kind of man. Yeah. Maybe give him... Hmm. <laughs> oh, man. Let's give him this one. You got like the Hawaiian shirt going on. I feel yeah. like that's a that's a good. This is looking it's a good look for him. Looking good, Dad. Yeah. Oh, we name get to name our dad. All right. Uh, his name will be. Uh, what should we name our dad? I don't know. What does he look like? He looks like Goku. Yeah. <laughs> um. Let's let's name him like. Uh, Frank, 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 Frank House. <laughs> I don't know. Frank, Frank Dad, Dadsman. <laughs> there we go. He, you know, he was actually raised just to be a dad by the whole Dadsman family. Mm -hmm. He was in a dad's club uh, in school. There, he, he, you know, he kind of looks like he might have been a part of the mafia at one time. With his mm -hmm. attire He's and his, his toothpick. toothpick. He, Frank Dadsman, is the greatest dad. He's the best dad. Mm -hmm. You know, we're going to be that dad. That's our dad. It's Frank Dadsman. He's going out to be the best dad he could ever be. Who, who plays dead? Who tries to sleep? Did you fall asleep packing? Yeah. <laughs> there he <laughs> is, Frank. I got most of it done, I think. Searching around the room, it looks like I did a pretty good job. Every box is sealed except for one. Wait, stra straggler. What's in it? Looking in the box, I see a bunch of old photos and little photo albums. Y you want to do the girl's voice? Alright. Well, I haven't seen these in years. I pull out a dusty album from the top of the pile and we begin looking through it. And there are baby pictures. That's the coolest baby I ever seen. <laughs> the only way your father and I, the only way your mother, okay, so were we were we married to a man <laughs> or were we married to a woman? I, I say I say he was like a divorced dad. Yeah. Uh, he he was he had he had a child. The only way your mother and I could get you to stop crying was to put sunglasses on you. But whenever we tried to take them off, you'd start crying again. You spent the first two years of your life with sunglasses on. Nice. <laughs> Halloween, when you were maybe four. Oh my god, that cute costume. Dragon. It's, dragon. That dra it's that dragon costume. Oh, I'm bad. You couldn't decide between being a princess or a dragon, so we want them both. Princess Dragon. Why do I remember crying in that dragon costume? You saw yourself in the mirror and realized you were afraid of dragons. <laughs> Seeing yourself inside the dragon's mouth was a realization of your greatest fear, I think. Right, yep, definitely rep repossess that memory. Repressed. I know, I get bad. You are bad. Uh-huh. And this was in your horse phase. I think every child has a horse phase. Did you have a horse phase? Mm, maybe, yeah. Uh, well, I did have a horse on a stick. I used to have a, I used to have a horse on a stick too. Mm -hmm. The horse head on a stick. Good yep. times. Yep. It had mm -hmm. noise. There you go. Dad. I believe you named that plush horse Sir Horsington the Brave. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that was his. Amanda lunges for the photo, but I quickly snatched away and hold it above her head with my superior dad arms. <laughs> Nice try, but this is important blackmail for later down the road, <laughs> says our edgy Goku dad. <laughs> Go ahead and try me. I, I've i seen pictures of you in Ska Band. Ska Band. Ska. Ska. I was right. Ouch, kid. The Ska Communist Manifesto had a chance back in the day. 
I look off in the distance and reminisce about that rad horn section. Hey, it's Emma P. No, Dad, that's Emma R. I didn't meet Emma P until high school. Honestly, I promise, or honey, I promise you wholeheartedly that I will never stop mixing those two up. Dad, Emma R has been my best friend since I was seventh grade. It's like a little bit of effort. Oh, right. Emma P was the one who <laughs> tried to steal people's pets, <laughs> fired a flaming tennis ball at the police station, <laughs> pooped her pants during a sleepover. What 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 was it that Emma P did? Um, P, she sounds like poop. She pooped her pants yeah. during a sleep. <laughs> oh, Dad, that wasn't me. I did that. Oh, oh. And I was having a sleep to sleep over with Emma R, who isn't Emma P. She never told anyone, though. True Blue, that's Emma R. Anyway, I gotta show show this to Emma R sh later. She'll get a kick out of it. The first photography award you ever won. Yeah, and it got us a $20 gift card to Mick Frazidays. It's, it's Mick Fridays. No, it's not. And then we got food poisoning from the Cheesy Tata's Blast. I think you mean f food poisoning, you know, with a Z. Dad. Still can't drive past Mick Fridays without gagging. <laughs> Still proud of you, though. Amanda reaches deep down into the box and pulls out the last photo. Neither of us say a word. We stare at the photo for a long moment. Finally decide to break the silence. This was the day you were born. <laughs> did we adopt <laughs> our child? Uh, or did no. I, I, I think yeah. we had this child. It's kind of a funny story. Got in a car accident right there in the hospital parking lot. Wasn't anything big, just a fender bender. But of course, I was freaking out, and that little old lady who crashed into us was freaking out, and I didn't know what to do. But your mother, oh man. She holds my hand and looks direct, <laughs> looked me directly in the eyes, the calmest I've ever seen her. She says, It's okay. It's all gonna be okay. Dot, dot, dot. She was right, you know. I stare at the picture for a long time. Maybe too long. I miss her. I can't even imagine what it must be like for Amanda. She pats me on the back. Come on, Pops. We gotta finish packing. The move, moving van won't wait forever. You're right. <laughs> You're right. Amanda and I pile into the car and take one last look at our old house. So many memories here. Hard to believe your mother and I bought this place almost 20 years ago. Hey, remember when I shattered the front window playing catch? You always had a very, you always had very strong arms. Hey, remember when I shattered the other front window pretending to be a robot who breaks windows? <laughs> you were a very imaginative child. <laughs> hey, remember when I broke the back window, PL? We get it, Amanda. You break stuff. And there we be plenty more stuff me f for me to break in the new place. Memories to make and stuff to break. <laughs> you ready? We sit in silence for a moment. I watch my daughter grow up in this house. I will forever hold this or forever hold a place in my heart. But it stings a little bit to leave it behind. I'm ready. The moving van begins pulling away and I get into the car and I get the car into position to follow it. I watch our house, our old house, disappear in the rear view mirrors. So dot dot dot. So what? So sell me on our new on our cool new pad. I clear my throat and do my best cheesy announcer voice. Nestled in beautiful scenic downtown Maple Bay, our new house features washer and dryer hookups, a two car garage. Multiple places to sleep. <laughs> Why not? Multiple places to sleep. Not only are there bedrooms for your sleeping pleasure, but couches and floor space where you can, yes, catch a wink. Hmm. What a deal. I mean, if if I sleep, if sleep weren't for the weeks. You sleep more than anyone I know. 
I admit my fault, Pops. I keep it real. Anyway, it's also smaller than our last house. Cozier, one more argue. Wait, one more argue. Good spin. I think it's great. Won't be closer to a lot of cool stuff we can walk to. So I didn't have to waste gas. I mean, trying to pack downtown is, you know. Amanda, you know you're going to have to learn how to parallel park at some point, right? Not going to happen, Pops. I think someone needs to do a three-point turn on their attitude. <laughs> I don't... I didn't know how to do that either. Have you met my, the neighbors yet? Not yet, but the neighbors seem pretty quiet. So you won't have any chase and rowdy teens on the, off your lawn? You are the very teen you mock when you say that, honey. <laughs> In my last year of high school, I'm practically dust. Yeah? You're a real... Don't you dare. Senior. <laughs> Dad, I know where this is going. Citizen. I'm just gonna <laughs> ignore that. But I won't forget it. So what about the number of new houses again? Well, first we need to forge a path through the solid wall of boxes that's blocking the living room. I still have to install a washer and dryer. We need to go grocery shopping. Pops, cool your jets. We have to promise me to get... We're gonna take a break and explore the neighborhood. Okay, okay, you're right. We'll get some work done and then check the area out. We pull up to the new house and step outside. The lawn is freshly mown and the for sale sign is still in the yard. Ah, yeah. And with a swift kick from Amanda, the for sale sign is no more. Nice work, sweet, or nice form, sweet pea. I got a problem with Ar Argony, Arthony, something. Can you not read? No. I got a problem with authority. <laughs> oh, I thought I was like Arthur. I'm so proud. <laughs> See, our, our dad used to be a, a, a mafia dad. <laughs> <laughs> Man, all that karate chopping tired me out tuckered me out. I could really go for a sandwich. That's still you. Oh, an ice cream sandwich. Sweetie, it's 10 a.m. <laughs> we need to unpack first. We need some coffee ASAP. <laughs> Did you even see all the dogs in the park nearby? I think that's the right <laughs> yeah. one. You know it. Thank you for moving us to an area where a dog... Where the dog to person radio is very ratio is very high. I only want what's best for you. I hope you're pretending to be frequently at which I interrupt conversation to yell dog is a rocket way up. I mean, you do that all Hey, it's a dog. Wait, false alarm. It's just a funny shaped rock. If you want to see real dogs so bad, let's go to the park around the corner. <laughs> Practice makes permanent. That's dad tip 58, if you didn't know. Got a nice new house. Amanda and I begin a stroll through the neighborhood. I can't believe how beautiful the out or it is outside. Kids are playing in the street and the flowers are in bloom. And the faint smell of nearby barbecue drifts through the air. <laughs> this place is nice. Too nice. I just don't trust it. Good eye, honey. You can never be too careful. See that baby in the stroller over there? Government operative. <laughs> We're on to you, baby. Probably boss baby. <laughs> <laughs> we walk for a while and eventually end up at the small park. Toddlers chase each other through the playground. All, and all dogs of all shapes and size romp through the grass. It's pretty crowded, but Amanda spots a nice empty bench. We start to make our way over it to it when... Heads up! Ah! <laughs> a frisbee suddenly hits me in the face. Woof! Fucking dog. It's a corgi! A corgi with a neat plaid handkerchief tied around its neck bounds up to me, wagging its tail. Neat. Hello? Did you throw this thing at my head? I like your necktie. Let's... <laughs> that's, that's... I think I, I like your necktie. Give it a compliment. The dog says rough. 
He runs around in circles and nudges my leg with his nose. Oh, God. This is the cutest dog. <laughs> <laughs> Can I help you? Impart upon me your wisdom, <laughs> tiny dog. Yeah. Woof, woof. How did you know? How long do I have left? How did you know? Do you have tomorrow's lottery numbers? How long do I have left? Grr. What's that? <laughs> I'm already too late. My fate was pre predetermined for me a long ago. I have no real agency in this cruel lifetime. <laughs> Rough, rough. You're right. I am the master of my domain, for fate is unknowable. Thank you, wise dog. <laughs> Arf. You definitely could have caught that. <laughs> Look at this guy. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's Dream Dad right there. Dream. A guy in a Hawaiian shirt jogs over to us and takes the frisbee from me. You know, frisbees are traditionally caught with hands, not your face. Well, you're traditionally not supposed to aim for people's heads. It's a new technique. I'll catch you with my teeth next time. Which one? Teeth. Teeth. All right. You caught me off guard this round. Not again. Not ever again. Ha! I'm just messing with you. I'm Brian, by the way. We got, we got Brian. <laughs> Brian acquired. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Brian acquired. Look at this. Making progress. I'm a, I'm Frank. This is my daughter, Amanda. Look over at Amanda to find her sitting on the ground, rubbing the dog's tummy. Hi. You dog coom. Your dog's coom. Ah, old Maxwell sure loves the attention. It's great to see another father and daughter out here on such a sunny day. <laughs> Where's yours? Brian gestures over to the grassy knoll where a young girl sits on a checkered blanket. She's reading a book bigger than her head. She puts it down and heads over to us. This is Daisy. She's the brother's Karmas. Karm, she's reading the brother's Karmazov? I can't read shit. Karm Her teacher tells me that she has the reading comprehension skills of a high schooler. You're saying you can't read. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Shut up. Shut up. <laughs> well, yeah. How old is she? Ten. She's a precious little youngster. <laughs> oh. My natural dad instincts kick in. I must brag about my child's accomplishments. Oh no, it's happening. <laughs> what is oh, this? It's, it's... <laughs> <laughs> Pokemon. Go on, Daisy. Tell him, or go on, Daisy. Tell him about yourself. That's you. Oh. Go ahead. Um, uh... That's my girl. Eh. Amanda, get in there. Amanda, go, go. Oh, go. Okay, okay. <laughs> Frank's HP <laughs> 80. Brian's HP 80. Is this really good? <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm going to brag. Amanda here just recently won a local photography award. Wow, congratulations. Brian loses 10, <laughs> 10 HP. HP. Daisy actually just won a statewide poetry contest. You lose 15 HP. Hmm. Alright. What else? Do you have any items? Grade card, child art. Spell Band-aid. What is a band-aid going to do? Oh, it's going to heal him. With a flourish, with a flourish, you produce a band-aid from your pocket. Take a knee and start to apply it to Amanda's arm. <laughs> what are you doing, Dad? Being a protective parent. Any would ag anyone would agree it is an unusual gesture. You lose. Ah, shit. Mm. Daisy just started a weekly chess club at her elementary school computer lab. She's the president, too, of course. Dang, my high school doesn't have any chess club or a computer lab. Damn. We're getting our asses kicked. We are. Can't switch daughters. We don't Amanda have is your only daughter. <laughs> Shit. Uh, let's do grade card. grade card. You pull a wrinkled copy of Amanda's last grade card out of your po back pocket. Dad. Awesome oh, grades. 25. Brian loses there 25. There we go. You really carry that around everywhere? 
Ouch, maybe it's kind of weird. You lose 5 HP. <laughs> what? Oh. Daisy sold enough candy bars this year to get the top prize. A canoe. We're talking... We're taking it out next weekend. How is that even possible? Amanda could barely get one of those sticky hand... Or sticky hand things. <laughs> it's extra powerful. You lose 20. We're getting our asses kicked. Last week... Um, <clears throat> last week, unprompted, Amanda helped out an old woman with her grocery bags. It's, it's extra, extra powerful. powerful. Did I mention that Daisy said her first words at ten months? Daddy. Hmm. Amanda's, Amanda's was potty. Still, cute, but maybe this isn't the time to bring it up. You lose ten HP. Alright. Alright, we, we need to really pull something out of the bag this hmm. time. Should we just brag? What else we have in items? We have child art, and we have a spelling bee photo. If he pulls out a child art, it might be weird, like you said. Maybe the, the photo. Yeah. I feel like... Fumbling through your phone's browser, you manage to pull up a photo of Amanda winning her 10th grade spelling bee. Wow, congratulations, Amanda. Daisy is getting prepared for her annual spelling bee right now. Hopefully this will be her third win in a row. Shit! Daisy has all of her adult teeth. Never had a cavity either. Amanda self-consciously pushes her lips together to hide her teeth. It's extra powerful. Ah, oh, we lost. Aww. Dang, he's really got us, got us beat. Boy, it's been such a treat getting to meet you two. <laughs> ah! <laughs> did, he, did he have to add insult to injury by being such a gracious winner? <laughs> so... I take it you guys are new in the neighborhood. We just moved in. Do you live around here? Yeah, we actually live in the cul-de-sac. Down, down next to the coffee shop. Well, what a convenience. That's where I live too. Small world. Yeah, Daisy and I are in a little ranch-style house on the corner. I know that house. It's just like ours, but slightly bigger and better landscaped. Does this guy have an out... This guy have to outdo me at everything? <laughs> what a lovely place. Well, I don't want to take up any more of your time. Really nice meeting you guys. You'll have to stop by at some point. Yeah, definitely. Bye. Brian and Daisy walk further into the park, with Maxwell happily trotting along in tow. Alright, uh... Should we keep going, or you think we should call it? I don't know. I think we can go for a little mer, a little little, little more. Mer. Let's let's finish this up here. Yeah, let's get this mer done. Right, okay. Dot dot. Do you get the feeling that uh, he was trying to one up us? Trying to succeeding? I can't believe the kid's only ten. I was even. What I what was I even doing at her age? Uh, I believe you had a bit of thing for horses. Shame that didn't pan out. Could have made. Majored in competitive horse horse studies. It's not too late to minor in horse creative writing. <laughs> too close to truth, Dad. Let us never speak of fantastic adventures or sore horsington, the brave and epic in several par parts of by Amanda D Dadsman. Dadsman. <laughs> Dadsman. Yeah, I forgot that was her last name. The Dadsman family. <laughs> We laugh off the epic hor or the horse epic and walk around the park a bit more, enjoying the day. Should we go to the coffee shop? I th I think this is where we can leave yeah. it. Um, what we can do here is we can uh, have the comment section decide. Yeah. Uh, who went, where we should go next? We have the coffee shop. We can go back to the house to unpack, or we can go or take a nap. Take a nap. <laughs> Just go take a nap. So uh, yeah, this has been a. Uh, uh, Dream Daddy, the dad. I what the name was the the dad dating simulator game. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, uh, yeah, thank you everybody for watching. Uh, thank you Brock for being here with us. My pleasure. Um, I'll put a link to Brock's channel in the description. You want to give us a little little insight uh, to what you do, where we can find you. You like vlogs? You like cooking with Brax? <laughs> Come over. Brock your bro. B R O S K Y A B R O. Alright, and like I said, I'll put a link to that in the description. Again, uh, 
Thank you all so much for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you all in the next video.